Boom. Boom. Oh, almost a full stack. 63 greater. That is a beautiful arcade shard. Keep on going. Just keep on going. The things we do for content sometimes. The dedication is real. to a brand new episode of Skybounds. We're here on the Monster Island, as always, and we have a very, very intense episode today, finishing off our grand adventure of opening up as many openables as possible. We're here. We have a lot to open today. We have a few things left over. I took some of your guys' thoughts in mind and your comments, and I appreciate each and every one of you, but I took it in my in thoughts in mind, and I definitely want to do Arcane Shards because... If I still have the screenshot, I'll put it up on screen, but I was on Ancient recording a video with Char um, about a month ago, maybe two months ago now, but somebody got an Immortal Shard from an Arcane Shard. It popped up in chat, which I'd never seen before, and I didn't even think it was possible, but I do want to test that theory with a lot of Arcane Shards, specifically, uh, technically, 347 arcane shards. I looked everywhere on the island, guys, for three more arcane shards. But 347 is more than enough. It will take me a lifetime to open them. But I will show you how to do a few of those. But first, we have a few other things. I have been collecting my boxes of chocolates. I can't get 64 of these without opening them. I just find them too much fun to open. So, they're, I mean, they're one of the newest openables in the game. So I do have seven collected from basically two weeks worth and... Somebody uh, gave me one with their Cupid bonus set, which is really fun. We also have our weeklies all the way up to Eternal, every rank in the game, one of one crate for each. And I mean, the Eternal has possible Immortal kit, possible Immortal kit in the Savage, possible Immortal kit in the Legend, and not in the Ultra, which is fine. So that you know that would fit. You would think that would be enough. I would too. I would too normally, but this is going to be our last episode for this adventure, so we do have a few other bonuses. We have 64 Transforming Skulls. I'm going to see if it's possible to get my own name, to get my own player skull, um, and see just who else's player skull I get, which is basically making it a huge shout-out video, which is going to be really, really fun. And last but not least, we have Confetti. I do not have a stack of each confetti, but in all, we have over 580 confetti to open. So I thought, you know, that's going to be really fun. Now, I think we still have an arcane shard area. There's our arcane shard box, which may not be enough, but that's okay. We might make another one, but we also have five boxes for confetti because it's probably going to take up quite a bit of space. I, 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 I would think so. And on top of all that, we do have one random immortal shard. If our weeklies and the arcane shards and the box of chocolates doesn't give us an immortal shard, we can still open an immortal, a random immortal shard and see what we get. So let's start this off because there is so much to do and I'm really excited to get through all of this awesome stuff and just finish off our opening special and get back to that prestige grind. So here we go with Ultra. <sighs> or C box, please. We know it, guys. Our... Boxes of pure joy, don't give me a flight herb. Boxes of pure joy? Yes, boxes of pure joy, because I love mining. How many do we get? A three or seed box. Can't complain about that at all, guys. Cannot complain. So we'll go with the legend. I'm not seeing an immortal shard, but that is okay. We'll go for those boosters. Hopefully it's the best item, in my opinion, you can get out of it out of this. There goes the mortal boot. 75k. I mean, we'll take it. We'll take it. We'll take some. Oh, I'm stuck on a chest. Here we go. 75k in the bank. We're now at 32 mil, which is basically donations from people that are indeed on the island that have helped me out in some way or another. Uh, they just keep donating to me. So thank you guys. You guys make this so much easier to get stuff done. I've also been doing challenges in the background, guys. A few of them. Some of the easier ones, like kill 100 blaze. You don't need to see that. Just know that I've, I've completed those ones because they're, they're a little too easy. Uh, three hour orb of flight. <sighs> Okay, Eternal Weekly. Can I even see a shard? Police? Please? Yes, there is one! Okay, okay, what is it? <gasps> is that a random? It's a random immortal shard. Oh my god, look at all the boosters though. Three, two, one, and close. Two boosters, two boosters. That is not bad. It would have been nice to get a random immortal shard, but thankfully we do already have one. 
so I don't have to worry too, too much about it. Now, seven boxes of chocolate is going to be really fun. I'm really excited for this. <gasps> is that Dyson on the island? <gasps> it has been forever since you've been on the island. Uh-oh, where'd you go? He's lagging. He's lagging all over the place. <gasps> Hello. <laughs> it's been forever. Okay, let's open our boxes of chocolate. What do we get? A 15 name fragment box. That's not too, too bad. I mean, it's all right. I don't, I don't want name fragments. Pot of gold. Ooh, maybe we'll get a lucky piece. Maybe. Let's pop it open. See what we get. Emerald Dorsey level one. Not bad at all. What's our next one? Oh my rose bushes. I, just, I, I, I didn't mean to throw it out. I didn't mean to. I just, I'm gonna, you know, decorate the island a little bit. There you go. Not this one though. That one doesn't look good. There we go. Let's decorate the island just a little bit around the edges. That's so cute. Okay, let's keep opening these. Global Challenge XP Booster we do not need, but we can activate it for the server. So right now, because of me, the server has two times Challenge XP Multiplier activated. If the person who activated isn't level 50, you can do slash thanks and give them, I think it's like 5 XP a person, which, I mean, it all adds up in the end, you know? It all adds up. It all adds up. Here we go. 15 or seed box. Oh, that's so much money. And our last one is an item XP booster. I mean, I still need those. I, I don't have enough. Um, do we have a uh, chest somewhere? Maybe? To put this stuff in? Uh, this chest will do for now. This is fine. We don't want any of this on us right now, guys, because we want to see what we're going to get in our openables today and we don't want to get it all mixed up so someone's reacting to a reaction i had in a video gotta give them a little heart there you know help them out what am i doing what am i doing i am putting the boosters away and i will put the random immortal shard away for now just in case we get one but like i said on ancient it actually said that they got a specific immortal shard so we'll see we'll see we'll see um put our rc boxes away we do not want those in the inventory. We will keep the party confetti box and we don't need the name fragment box. So that's fine. Here we go. Arcane shards. This is what we're doing. I'm a, I'm, I'm a little nervous. It's going to be a lot of stuff. It's going to be a lot, a lot, a lot of stuff. Excuse me? Can I jump? <laughs> I can't even jump. Okay. Arcane shards. Slash alk or alchemy. You can spell it all the way out. I just put ALC. It's a lot shorter. Time to do one by one. I will record the entire thing as always, guys. You know that. But, you know, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. We're opening a lot of them. We might have a chance here getting a random immortal shard. Or just a mortal shard. I think it's a specific one. But I don't know. Working through those arcane shards. So good ways to get arcane shards. Now. You can get them out of openables. We've seen it out of almost all the openables in the last, like, two weeks of recordings. Most openables give arcane shards, which is really freaking awesome. So an easy way to get, look, a full stack of normal dust. What? Like, that? that's good stuff, man. You need dust. You need dust to level up books. And those books you can use to make gear. That's basically... The gist of it. I'm actually making use of my two times multiplier on the server right now and getting more and more experience if I could actually gain experience, but that is fine. We're almost through a stack, almost. My finger is going to be dead by the end of this. It's not gonna work anymore. We're now forfeiting XP because we can't actually obtain this much XP. You have a limit per day, but this actually is a really good way to get experience really quickly. I'm going to do this for the next, you know, I'll let you know how long it takes me to open up almost a little over five stacks of arcane shards. Okay, 38 in this stack, not too bad of a stack, and then we will have four full stacks to open. So this one definitely, I felt it really needed to be more than 64, because I've opened 64 before and never, ever got an eye kit from it. So I thought... Better way to show it off is to open, you know, more than the one stack in this case. Just, you know, it's basically bettering our odds. It, it's always on probability. I mean, it's it's probably like a point zero 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 five chance of, of actually getting it. Don't quote me on that, but I assume it's a very, very small percentage of chance. <gasps> what? I got... 
got a forge essence. I didn't even notice. It's there. I swear I saw I swear it came that way. I didn't even notice it go in my inventory. Oh my goodness. I didn't even know that was possible. What? I actually thought it was a booster, guys. I got really excited. I mean, you could sell dust as well. A lot of people look for it. I mean, your best way to get dust, though, honestly, even by doing this, I would say it's by killing witches or allowing witches to die on your island from fall damage. That's how I had my witch spawner set up before, and I have so much dust on my island just from AFKing on the island. Um, no, a mortal shard. I really actually thought we might get one. I don't know why, but like with that many, I really thought we might be able to get one. Maybe they're taken out of the loot table now. I'm not sure. I'm very curious to find out though. All right, so let's throw all this in. Not too bad. Almost a little over half a half a, a full chest of greater arcane dust with three forge essence. A full box of arcane dust. Almost a full box of lesser, and almost a second full box of arcane dust. That's it. That was it. Nothing all that exciting. I mean, we always need dust, but I mean, I used to AFK my blazes a lot up there, and we have our witch spawners were up there at the time, and we ended up with, I mean, three full boxes of lesser, two three, almost three full boxes of the white, and almost a full box of the great arcane dust. So, you know, it's all right. It's all right. It's pretty good. So we're going to move on with the other things in this episode. Now I'm going to put this challenge pass away and see. Oh, I just fell in the water. <laughs> oh, okay. Challenge passes need to go away in here. We are sitting on 47 challenge passes. Let's see here. 47 and 9. So 56. Six. If we don't prestige, guys, guys, it'll be on me. On me. All on me. But anyway, opening up all those arcane shards took like a good 25 minutes of recording. So I'm just going to show you guys the cool parts. I mean, realistically, the end and a little bit of the beginning. And who chopped my flowers? I just placed these. Who chopped my flowers? <laughs> That's so mean. Those are my flowers, guys. Anyway. Let's open up the box and get our party confetti out. I am pretty excited to see what's all in here. Now we're going to need a new chest area. My island. This is why we need to prestige, guys. I need to get off this island. It's getting a little too crazy house going on here. So we're going to grab our chest. They're down in the pot of gold. Chest. Don't ask me why. It's just how life works sometimes. We'll grab five container locks to go with it. This should be enough for a confetti. It should be. So I think we're just going to come place it over here with, oh, we'll just put them there. Uh, fly? I have turkey set on. That's the only reason I can fly all the time, guys. If you ever wondered, just put that away. Grab our container locks. Oops, I didn't, I didn't, uh, place enough chests. There we go. There's all my five chests. Container lock back in the inventory. Throw out the seed. We don't need it. Don't throw out anything else. We absolutely do need that. So here is... 584 confetti. It's going to take a while. This is definitely going to take a while. So we're just going to clear a nice little area. We'll move the flower over. No. I know you can throw them out, guys. I keep my flowers. We'll just place them like that. And this one can go here. All right. I think we're ready. We're looking at this god-awful thing. I, I'm, I want to finish that tree, guys. I really do. But let's start. So we're going to start with, I think this is cyan. No, that's cyan. So this would just be blue or light blue, not dark blue. We just got wool. Is this really the appropriate time for someone outside to be mowing their lawn? Okay, guys, we're back. I believe the neighbors are done mowing their lawn. This is what we get. We're almost to summer, which is like, honestly, we're going to get close to the one year of the channel, which is just crazy. Crazy to think we've been doing this. Oh my goodness. Like what? We're April and we started our channel late June or late July. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. So we're going to do the confetti. We are going to cut back because honestly, mining will pass, ground wool, or sea box, four or seeds. Ooh, challenge XP, economy ticket. Oh, these are so quick. Bop, 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 So last but not least, guys, is 23 orange confetti. If you do not know, here's a little tidbit about me. This is indeed my favorite color. I love orange. I don't build out of it necessarily, but I think you can tell from my outfit. I got a little orange dress on. Whoops, I forgot the boots. 
We got an orange dress on. It's a little bit yellowish orange gold almost, but we got 23 orange confetti. We're almost done. We get a kill tracker as the first one. Slam them out as fast. I love that these spam so quickly in there. We're done. We're done. We've just opened like 587 confetti. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's throw everything in the chest quickly so we can see what we have in the end. I mean, a ton of Challenge XP bottles. Uh, worth doing. I mean, pop them and see how much you get from it. Anywhere from 50 to 150. Like, that's pretty good. That'll level you up really quickly. 38 500 Starry Cook tickets. That's $19,000. Here's um, $110,000. A full stack of Enderman spawn eggs. That's interesting. Tons and tons of ore seeds. Hello. Can't wait to open those. And three holiday hats. That was incredible. Way better. Way better things. And, and different surprises than I expected than just the dust that we got. And the forge essence from the arcade shards. I mean, this is pretty cool. Pretty cool. I actually really like it. I think confetti is definitely worth doing if you are someone who likes to work or seeds. But the chest is empty now. It's empty. It's empty. But in all here, we have 64 transforming skulls. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. I'm going to open 64 of them anyway and see whose head we get that is currently on the island. I mean, there's a decent amount of people online. A lot of people I know, which is good. I kind of want to get their heads. I want Trickshot's head. If I can get his, that would be really fun. Solus, I want his. Who else do I want? Who else have I seen online a lot? I mean, I'd love to get Dice Logos, this player head. I think that'll be freaking awesome. I mean, it's always nice to get a mod's head. We do have one mod online. But, I mean, the big question is, is will we get our own player head? Why I keep getting stuck on blocks today, I do not know. Skybounds, what are you doing? We have no chests left. A chest holds 27, so two chests would be 54. So we actually need two double chests to contain all of this madness. And I think we still have some wood over here. Yes, we do. Let's go old-fashioned. Make ourselves some chests. Oopsie. We'll just quickly make up 32 so we have them. All right, and I mean, we don't have to go anywhere too specific for these. I think we'll just put them right here. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Let's put it right here. Just put two, get rid of the torch. All right. We need light here because obviously we have a problem on the island with mobs because they come and kill me all the time. Let's just get rid of some of this dirt or gra uh, grass. Grass, yeah. Right, throw that in the void. We don't need that. Why do you keep coming back to me? There we go. Okay, okay. Almost ready, guys. And then we will be able to open up 64 <laughs> player heads. Someone said I should. And I listened. I listened, guys. I listened. I think it's going to be fun. Let's see if we can get our own head. I mean, there's 64 here in various amounts of, I mean, 38, 39, 48, 50, 64. Yeah, so just various amounts of different stacks. I think we're going to start with that one. All right. Three, two, one. Who do we get? Daniel Schmitz. Okay. I don't know him. Hello. Here we go. Oh, I knew it! I called it! I got my head on the second one! I called it! Yes! <laughs> that is awesome, guys. I am so excited about that. Let's keep going. Let's see if we can get Dyson's head. Come on. Who we got? Thanatos Returns. I like your name. I just got a second one in my head! Ah, oh my god! Another one. <laughs> I have so many of my own head now. Okay, okay. Who's that? P Dog. Yes. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. I got your head now. Okay, okay. Next one up. We're gonna just throw these up in here. Okay. How many of my player head am I gonna get by the end of this? This is gonna be great. Okay, okay. Oh. Kill Clash Crafter. I like your player head. Gia MH67. Oh, <laughs> there's Solus' daddy, the guy who actually donated me, uh, donated me a huge gift on the last, on the last episode. It was just, it was just insanity. I can't believe I just got his head. Hey, <laughs> there you are. <laughs> I got your head. <laughs> All right, let's keep going, guys. Oh, who's this? Who's this? The real raptor. Nice. A Steve head, ender dragon. 
Never Kill Me Pleb. <laughs> That's a great name. I like your name, my dude. Log is sure. Log is sure? Gamer? I'm probably not saying that right. Okay. Okay. Who is it? Jurish. Oh, I think that's a German name. I think that's a German name. Solus Exotics. He just found out I was a YouTuber. Probably our brand new uh, subscriber today. But, you know, hopefully. Hopefully. We'll see. Oh, I know. I know him too. I know all of these guys. Oh my goodness. I've seen you guys on the island all the time. Topher Gopher. And who was the one I didn't actually call out? Xenox HD. I've seen you on the server all the time. Who else we got? Get wrecked, bro. Get wrecked, bro. I like that one. That's a good head. Sappy Weppy. <laughs> What's with these names? <laughs> um, another Topher Gopher. All right. What? Another get wrecked, bro. What is happening? That one stacked too. Where did it stack? We got another Xenox HD. We're getting stacked heads here. Dallin's head. Oh my god. Who's that? Jfish? I love these names. There's a... Aw, oh, you got an Alex skin, my dude. You gotta set up a skin for yourself. Buy Quartz's head. Our Alex skin will go with our Steve head here. You guys need to get some player skins. There's a Chewbacca! It's like a Jerome head. Master Hunter 2's head. Last one of this stack... Vintage Filters Head. All right, we got eight here, and then our last one will be our 30. Here we go. What do we got? What do we got? Overlime. That is our mod, I believe. Yes, it is. I called it. I knew I'd get a mod head. I knew I would. Oopsie. Yay. Mod head. Mod player. Oops. Oh my god, guys. I can't type. <laughs> Yay, mod player head. I knew I'd get one. Here we go. Who else we got? Who else? Furturb? I don't know if I'm saying your name right, my dude. Nefties? Um, who we at? Five Dark Wolves. I just saw him talking in chat. Oh, that is freaking awesome. Okay, four left. Someone just stacked. Nefty stack. Nefty. Nice, nice. Who else? Fusion Virus's head. Redstone DJ 10's head, and the last one in the stack actually stacked up somewhere. I have a third Nephthys V. Wow. Okay. Let's put all of these in a chest. Whew. Oh, anyone who wants their head, they can come and get it. If you want it, message me. If you're on this list, guys, message me. I'll give you my head. It's created by me. I know that's kind of cool. Oh, that's the ones we need to open. I absolutely love when these happen. I think it's pretty cool. I can't believe we got Solus's daddies and Overline, which I'm going to give him his in a bit we'll put him down here so we got 30 left to go cannot believe i still got two of my own player head here we go let me cry that's such a sad name i just got two in a row of this kid oh my god that's awesome okay another steve kid yoshi yoshi go get yourself a yoshi type skin my dude that'd be super cool i want to see a yoshi we already got that head already who else we got justice crotter never got that one before Two overlimes. <laughs> ah, that sucks. <laughs> two of the mods heads. Two of mine. It's not bad so far. Come on. <laughs> Mod goes why? Vicarious Echoes. That's a nice player head, dude. Eurus Shivs. We already had him. Anyone new? We haven't. Buy Nutellas. <laughs> That's a great name, dude. I like your name. That's our, like, fourth Nephthys. We've got a lot of your head. If you want them, you can have them. I might keep one just because I had so many of them. Another Dallin head. We are getting tons of repeats. I just got a third of my own head. There's three now, guys. Oh, my goodness. Jason. Who else? Michelle Top. Another Chewbacca Master Hunter. GG. Craggy Tobies. We're running out, guys. Nashalas or Mashalias? Mashalias? A double master hunter. Ooh, that's a new one. That's a cool player head. Daniel Schmidt. I like it. Oh, you're such a cute player head. Demoniac do I like it. New one? No, get wrecked, bro. We got a ton of your head already. This one just stacked. Who's stacked? I think it was Sefi Webby. Which I think I now have three of your player head. We got another stack. Oh my goodness. Oh, a new head. 
MC Ben 23 and call me does that say call me God call me godly basically okay someone stacked there's another by Nutella Xander freak 64 the creator yes he loves giving me a box of chocolate I believe he was my winner of my cupid set I gave away and he continues to give me boxes of chocolates all the time when I'm online which is just awesome and our last one for the day was a duplicate it was another master hunter holy jeez wow that is really cool all right guys so 64 transforming skulls ended up giving me three of my own player head which is really cool so anyone who got a shout out today i thought it'd be a nice neat way to shout out a bunch of people that are on monster active right now and you know what and see what you know see what the odds are we didn't get dyson's player head which i thought was really surprising considering we got three of our own player head which is just crazy two of the mods and a bunch of player heads of people i already know on the server tons and tons of people that was just really fun i wanted to see what would happen I'm in awe that we got so many of our own, but we did indeed have one random immortal shard somewhere that I want to open and see what it what it contains, what could be inside it. I mean, we've unlocked so many eye kits on this island. Our luck on monster has been phenomenal. I mean, there's a lot of eye shards we don't unlock, but overall from those monthly crates we get you know almost two shards every month from them and it ends up that we've opened up a lot of shards. So what are we looking for right now? We already have an illusionist sitting waiting we ha oh, I'd like bunny. I'd like flower and reindeer, actually. And I mean, the back one's Santa. Santa. I still want Santa. I've always wanted the Santa eye shard. I remember purchasing so many of them. A little pay, pay, to, pay to look good, as I call it. Kind of like on Fortnite. You don't pay to win. You pay to look good. But here we go, guys. We have a random immortal shard. What is it going to give us? Three, two, one. Oh, that's a good eye shard. That's a Cupid eye shard. That is a beauty. That is a free way of getting immortal shards. The Cupid from those boxes of chocolates we talked about earlier. Oh my goodness. All right, guys. It is the last episode of our crazy adventure. It has been so much fun and so rewarding. And I know I talked about that pirate immortal shard a long time ago guys but you know what we're at the end of this entire week almost two weeks of episode grinding and getting all of these openables opened we were pretty darn lucky throughout the whole thing which is why i'm giving away a pirate immortal shard because pirates like to hold on to gold and treasures and because I love you guys so much for all the support you guys give me and all the love like we hit 2300 subscribers yesterday what what like guys thank you welcome to the channel if you haven't been here before welcome i mean this might be your first time or you're seeing this episode like i don't know two years later who knows who knows i'm gonna be around for a very long time i can't wait to continue grinding out the content but because i love you guys so much a second giveaway is going out for this cupid immortal shard two giveaways for the final explosion of this episode i am so glad to finally hey i'm so glad <laughs> i'm so glad to finally have gotten through all of these episodes it has been crazy there is so much loot on my island my island has taken been taken over by chests of loot and i can't wait to start opening all the things that are inside each and every openable i mean we have blue war zone crate sitting places or seeds i have so much money to be made in this area I don't even know if I'm going to organize this into my house. I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but I mean, we have tons and tons of stuff, but we need to get back on that prestige grind as much fun as all of this has been. We need to get back into the game of Skybounds and back into, you know, not just opening really fun, awesome openables, you know, guys? So thank you guys so much for watching. Smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Come chill with the Glad Army. And as always... See ya!